So welcome everybody. Today we're going to be doing a, a live stream special. This is going to be the Migraine Trigger Mark 30. Um, it's the next in the line and I'm just going to be making a super carrier for the fleet. As you can see we've got the original Migraine Trigger Mark 1 just sort of chilling next to the canopy here for comparison purposes. And like I say at the moment it's completely hollowed out. I'm going to show you the uh, video of the speed build, well a speed build, so we're going to kick into that and then it's going to be live stream highlights as usual. So like I say, let's take a look at that because it's about four minutes long. So. It's popping on Twitch now, yeah? Mm-hmm. There'll be a bit of a delay. But essentially I oh, decided... It's... I was going to put together a really large canopy for this one because I wanted a really quite a large um, silhouette, quite a long sleek silhouette and so the only way to do that with the scale is to actually have a pretty large canopy to begin with. I'll probably actually put interior in the canopy this time with maybe docking for shuttles and things instead of just cramming it full of weapons. Um, there's plenty of room in here for a big gun or two if I need to so it's not really like a big thing to have it in the canopy this time. Also, because of the group count nerf, I'm hardly going to be using that either. Lots of groups. Probably use lots of different weapons instead. Um, I have got Dalmont and Yobo with me, but there's a bit of a time delay on what they're seeing. I mean, pretty much all it is is a speed build I'm on making the canopy. Oh, are you? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I've uh, come behind you, and uh, I've brought something. Oh, okay. Well, like I say, just now I'm just literally showing a video of the speed build off. So it's only a few minutes long. It's just so that people can catch up and see exactly where we're at, because I did this earlier today. And um, if I was to start the live stream from where I am, people would probably be like, hey, where'd you get the canopy from? But no, it was all done by hand. So. Mother of God, man. This thing makes the hailstorm look like cheese. It makes it look like a 24 hour job, doesn't it? Yeah, no, yep. it does. Because I so, thought. Hi. <laughs> He's still right there. Yeah, don't worry. I'll be switching back to it in a sec. I'm just uh, going through this speed build, like I say. Obviously, I had to put the trademark lighting on the back. I have done highlights as well. This speed, I sped it up, and it was still 14 minutes long at 900 speed. So this took probably a couple of hours. And so, yeah, just putting the detailing in on the... Uh, the mushroom impulse drive <laughs> and uh, something which is made a lot easier with the undo command because when you mess it up it's like not a big deal which is nice and yeah so pretty much started putting in some wedging and sealing up all the gaps make it look nice and And then just pretty much just sit there AFK because it's a pro speed build edit. <laughs> I was thinking about having those side entrances on the uh, canopy, but I'm gonna just I'm gonna do negative shell on this, so which will take forever, but it'll be worth it. I haven't decided on what color. Probably black, because black and purple. Black. Yeah. Um, probably with a bit of purple lighting underneath the black to light up the purple. Hey? What was that, General? I just said OP. OP. So there it is. That was the complete speed build. So yeah, basically X. What is this? X. There we go. Right. So I'm currently in what I would call my core. My core is actually here. And you can get into it by coming down this industrial-like passage, which isn't finished. But the idea of this is, well, yeah, you can shoot through the canopy, but there's going to be significant amounts of hardened hull around here too. And there's so much room for shields, it's just unbelievable. I don't really think power is going to be a problem either. So, yeah. Um, so I'm going to get into it, and I'll be doing more recorded highlights as I go along. So here we are. This is the current state of play. Done a little bit more work on the uh, Mark 30. As you can see, it's got a floor now. 
So yeah, not really much to report, but yeah, there'll be more in a sec. Okay guys, so as you can see, I'm not doing anything and there's no one else in my ship. Uh, it's regrowing. I've <laughs> I'm going to try and remove it. I think Tom's just discovered the auto build system. Look, it's coming back. No, bad purple hull. I'll have to come back to it. Uh oh. Okay, is this like a new mini game that I found? You know, bionic ships that regrow themselves. They cannot be build blocked because they just come back and you don't get any resources. I think I must have lagged out, guys. I never meant to give it life. I never meant to give it life, I swear. It just happened. You you guys all saw that, so... Okay then, guys. So that is now fixed. So the front end's clean. The back end's good. We're still around 2,000 meters, so this is nice. Okay then, guys. This is where we're currently at on the Migraine Trigger Supercarrier. This is version 30, and it's currently 2,000 meters long. The engines have to go on the back. There'll be a defensive platform at each, well, at either end of the uh, con tower, and then there's going to be a large runway type thing. So yeah, there it is, and it's growing. So I'll give you another recap very soon. Heavy Arms Custom Edition by EVN Jellion. And then I decided that I would uh, add a little bit of, uh, well, festivity. Something like this. They all come out of the right places. That's beautiful. Not quite done yet. EVN's Gundams. Okay. Best Gundams. There's. God mode is now on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should definitely have God mode on. We're in the sun, dude. Oh, the, the chest plate's opened. Yeah! Yeah! Heavy arms, baby! That's amazing. Except no heavy arms. Didn't he have two Gatling arms things on one arm? He just... You should dock them on, mate. They turned at the wrist. Mm -hmm. They did. They turned at the wrist. You could have just turret Gatling guns, turret Gatling guns top and bottom of the wrist. So I I oh, hang on. Let me just stop the music because no one can hear you. Shit. My bad. So, so I left most of it hollow for you because I have a feeling that you're going to have to come up with some crazy use for it. Uh, so you can kind of tweak it, but it has shields, it has thrusters. Logic and all that good stuff. I even use your logic though. Oh, nice. Um, for the non repeating thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, I'm just gonna. Here, you know what? Let's, should we go tall geese with this? Tall geese? Mm -hmm. What, are you gonna adapt it? No, no, no. Let's see. Do you remember in Gundam Wing when the tall geese? Uh, was going up against the Libra. Zach? I think so. You rode into battle on top of the ship. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Very nice, mate. I love it. Just look at those. Look at that sun. Can we get that all on the screen. <laughs> 